today we're going to put right the disaster <laughs> that we made the other day. Uh, so rather than waste a piece of material, I've just sprayed the back and I've leveled the table. Now a lot of you have written in the comments saying, oh why don't you skim the, the table? Well, I like to uh, do things a little differently and um, I know I should have been able to shim this table flat which is what I've done. Over the entire length I have within four thousandths of an inch which for a CNC router is okay. You know that's really pretty good actually. So now I'm gonna fix this to the wasteboard, uh, home the machine, uh, put the new code in and we're going to do that one today. Um, and it's a mixture of you know deep thick lines and thinner lines which will give you know us a, a very very good indication of this table being flat. We hope. So I want to give you a little bit of tuition about this SMC controller. Now I haven't uh, set the machine zero uh, or work offset or anything at the moment. So what I'm going to do first off is I'm going to put the new code in. Now it's reading the disk. So I'm going to open the file by just pressing that. And here we have the USB drive, press and there's the new file there, test 3 and you can either press the OK or this button again uh, to bring up this next little box uh, then you, you come up to the open, press and then that puts it into the into the memory of the machine or actually it reads it from the stick if the stick is still there and to, to check to see whether the code is in press this here and there's the G code to escape out of that you just press escape so the next thing I'm going to do now is to set the machine home so to do that we're going to press shift to so this goes dim okay then I'm going to press this button which is the home in coordinates uh, button and you can choose here for the machine home and press that And press OK. Oh, good idea if I take the reset off. It's the same as uh, Mag 3 and press OK. So now I'm going to take the gantry down the back of the machine and we'll fix this to the table.
we have a perfect V-bit carving uh, with a mixture of very deep uh, carving and uh, should we say shallow lines as well and right across the carving they you know they're they're the same so we have you know, a flat working surface and this is the sort of simple carving that this MIDI CNC router was built for and if you're interested in uh, a MIDI CNC router uh, all the plans and parts information and prices for those parts that I pay uh, is available on my patron pages this whole MIDI CNC router that I've designed was built for under $1,000 including the SMC controller and the electronic package. I've now made I think 17 videos on the making of this including making the, the electronic package, wiring it up and you know, starting up from scratch with the SMC controller, how to program it, then how to set it up with the with the motors, how to tune the router in, and um, there's the result, perfect result. I'm extremely happy. It's everything that I designed it for. Um, and I'm going to have a lot of fun with it, I think. So, if you've liked the video today, please like and subscribe. And uh, information for Cavco, which you see in the background there, that's Cavco Maker Plus. Um, there's three programs. That's Cavco Maker, Maker Plus, and Cavco, the main program. Um, and underneath this video, in the video description area, you will find a 5% discount code for Cavco. Any of their products, monthly, yearly, buy it outright, and what, you know, whether it's Maker, Maker Plus, or the main Cavco program. Uh, and that 5% applies whether you are a hobbyist, uh, uh, or a professional, you still get that 5% off. At this point I'd just like to thank my patrons because it's the patrons behind this channel that uh, you know helps me to bring you things like this. Uh, without their support I, you know, I just couldn't. So if you're interested in becoming a patron, the information for my patron pages are also underneath this uh, video in the video description area. Uh, also I'll mention too uh, that uh, also below this video, there's a lot of below this video, also below this video there is a discount code there for Fusion 360. If you don't qualify for the free hobby version then there is a discount for you down there as well. So thank you for joining me for this second attempt at V-Bit Carving. Uh, and you know, a perfect result this time. So uh, I'm very happy, very happy with the way this is performing too. And uh, look, when, when, if you do build one yourself, or even if you buy one, you will get niggling little problems when you start to, to use it. Incidentally, if you're interested in buying a CNC router, uh, I'll put a card up here to a video that uh, I sort of explain to you what to look for in a CNC router. Uh, and another card here for what you should be looking at in a laser. Okay then, so 
thank you for joining me and it's bye for now.